Number one, God longs to bless. He desires our flourishing and our fruitfulness, right? We see that in both the blessing that God gave, that God gave to Jacob and that Isaac gave to Jacob. You know, that you would be a blessing and that you would be fruitful. And that promise of a, of a goodly land inhabited by a godly people was the original, not only the Abrahamic promise, but it was the Edenic promise. That was God's creational intent. And we see it as we fast forward to the book of Revelation. That's where we're going. That's where we're going. A new heaven and a new earth inhabited by a godly people. And oh Lord, I want to be in that number when the saints go marching in. I mean, if a guy like Jacob can get in, as we're going to see, I can get in. And you can get in. Because we don't get in by jumping up to grab the ladder. The ladder comes all the way down to us. Even people like you and me. All right. You can't outrun your guilt. We've said that. We'll say it again. Because everywhere you go, there you are. Okay. You know how you resolve guilt? You meet Jesus. You encounter Jesus. You give it to Jesus. 